Hello, this is Nick from Laptop Media, and today we will show you how to open the Dell Latitude 15, 5550. To open this notebook, you have to undo eight captive Phillips head screws. Pry the areas behind the hinges with a lever tool to open gaps around these sections. Work your way around the rear, the sides, and the front with a thin plastic tool. This laptop is equipped with the optional 54 watt hour battery. The default model has a capacity of 42 watt hours. To remove it, detach the connector from the main board and undo the five Phillips head screws that fix the unit to the chassis. The optional capacity is enough for around eight hours and a half of video playback. To achieve that, you have to apply the best power efficiency preset in the Windows Power and Battery menu and select the optimized power plan in the Dell Optimizer app. According to Dell, the two SODIMs support up to 64 gigabytes of DDR5 RAM in dual-channel mode. However, since the CPU can support up to 96 gigabytes, this laptop likely wouldn't have issues running a larger amount of memory than the official manufacturer's specified limit. Keep in mind that the core ultra-based machines rely on 5600 megahertz memory, while the others have 5200 megahertz modules. There are two M.2 slots compatible with Gen 4 NVMEs, one for 2230 or 2280, and one for the shortest 2230 SSDs. A metal shroud that is fixed to the motherboard with two Phillips head screws covers the left slot. we found a small thermal pad beneath the cap. On the left of the memory slots, we can spot the W1 slot for optional LTE or 5G connectivity. The Wi-Fi card is placed above the SODIMs. The cooling system looks fine for an iGPU-only device. It comprises one fan, a pair of long heat pipes, one side-mounted heat sink, and a heat spreader.